The main objectives of this session is to give you a quick overview of Kempi MIG guns, followed by a step-by-step -step guide on how to correctly replace your MIG gun liner. First of all, I'd like to show you what ranges of MIG guns we can offer the marketplace. We start with a Kempi FE MIG gun. This is Kempi's entry-level MIG gun, available from 200 to 420 amps power rating, with a 35% duty cycle at 40 degrees centigrade. FE guns are available as gas-cooled 3.5 and 5 meter length versions. The MMT gun is our next level within the MIG gun range. MMT is a basic gun which is available in gas and water-cooled options in the range from 250 to 420 amps in gas-cooled and 300 to 520 amps in water-cooled version. The premium range of Kempi MIG guns for quality, durability and functionality is the Kempi PMT range or premium range. The PMT torch has technology allowing full control of your synergic parameters on your power source. This can be achieved by installing an optional RMT10 remote control. You can set your memory channels from this remote control and you can change between the channels without the need to leave the welding job. The PMT torch also has a built-in PTC resistor to monitor the temperature level within the torch. This avoids overheating. The PMT MN range is a PMT gun specifically designed for gas-cooled root pass welding. It includes multiple neck options, the design includes longer and tapered contact tips, making it easier for the welder to see and locate the weld pool. Making use of the PMT gun delivers more accurate, quicker and thus more productive welding than conventional MIG guns in root pass welding applications. PMT MN guns are a standard feature on our Fast MIG X Black twin feed package, specifically designed for pipe welding applications. In addition, the majority of our standard Kempi consumables fit all of our ranges of MIG guns, giving customers complete flexibility in their welding operation. Kempi consumables include the option for long life products, such as Long Life Plus MIG contact tips, designed to last up to five times longer than standard contact tips, and also the unique Kempi Chili Liner, which is made of new durable materials lasting five times longer than standard Teflon liners. I'm now going to hand over to my colleague Emil. He's going to demonstrate the correct process how to fit a chili liner into a Kempi PMT gun using a simple step-by-step -step process. Please note that full assembly instructions are included with your new liner kit. To replace a chili liner, you'll require the following tools. A spanner, a sharp knife, and a file. If you're replacing a standard metal liner, you will also need a set of pliers. The first step is to remove the nozzle, then the contact tip, the contact tip adapter, and finally the gas diffuser. Use a spanner to remove the brass liner jacket nut on the end of your Euro connector. Please ensure you pull the old liner out carefully. Use the file to remove any burrs from the metal part of the new liner. Unfold the new liner and slide the metal part of the liner onto the end of your Euro connector block. Slide it gently and move as slowly as possible to avoid bending the liner. 
do not cut the liner as yet. Once the metal part of the liner reaches the end of the torch cable, feed the liner through to allow at least 15 to 20 millimeters past the gooseneck. Insert the gas diffuser and screw the contact tip adapter about one and a half to two revolutions onto the thread. Do not fully tighten the contact tip adapter as yet. The Euro brass jacket nut has a marking on the side which you can use as a reference to mark the liner using a sharp knife. Mark the area of the liner where you want to cut. Make sure you cut the liner allowing at least 6 to 10 millimeters additional. With a sharp knife cut the liner at the mark with a forward and backward motion. Go to the Euro connector back end and secure the jacket nut, leaving an extra 10 millimeters in the front and back. This will make sure that there is no gap inside the torch.